essay morning, is it morning? Yeah, it's 20 past 10. <laughs> I'm trying to look at the time on my computer, it's really small. Um, it's 20 past 10 and I'm feeling really good today. Yesterday was the first day back after bank holiday and I tell you what, I felt like a zombie. I don't know why, I feel like it's that long weekend, you get an extra couple of days off and it just, it just sends you into some sort of like exhaustion mood do you know what i mean so yesterday was not the best day i didn't really do anything no that's a lie i did do stuff i always say this right i always say i didn't really do anything and then i think about it i'm like no you did do something <laughs> um but yeah i've just edited this morning a video which you would have already seen my jeans collection um i'm actually pretty chuffed with how it turned out let me know what you guys think. I am still struggling with the road noise kind of situation. I'm kind of just dealing with it and hope you guys don't mind. So where I do like a sit down video, I'll put a bit of music over the top. It just kind of drowns out any of the like annoying sound. Um, I hope you don't mind, but there's no other way currently that I can change that um, unless I get a new camera. And I can't afford to buy a new camera right now because I just bought myself a new laptop because my current laptop is dying on me. I don't know if you can hear that breathing noise. If you can't, it's making a breathing noise. Um, my laptop's on its last legs, but you know when you're just like, I don't really, really wanna buy one. And then I was like, no, I need to buy a new laptop. It needs to happen. So I bought that the other day um, and that's coming next week, I think. Um, I'm very excited about it. Um, my laptop's like eight years old, so no, seven years old. Um, and to be honest, if it wasn't like a work thing, if I didn't use my laptop so much for work, I wouldn't buy a new one. I'd wait till it was dying a bit more, but it's kind of dying enough to need a new one. And my work is important. Um, my arm hurts. Oh. Um, so yeah, today is a kind of content creation, editing kind of day-ish. Um, what else do I have to tell you? Uh... Not much. Oh, my Zara order's coming today. So there'll be a Zara haul also coming very soon, probably before this video, because Zara videos take priority. <laughs> um, also been really struggling recently with just kind of getting myself, like, into a routine. Obviously, you guys know I've recently moved to London, and I, I'm so grateful and happy to be here. Like, I feel so lucky that I'm here and I get to do this. Um, but I've really struggled to get into like a routine of like working, normal life, like enjoying myself a little bit. It's really, really difficult. Um, and I think where now life is starting to go back to normal a bit more, I am starting to feel a little bit more like I can get myself into a routine. I don't know. I feel like it was quite hard before. Um, and I'm just trying to get myself, make myself work and make myself do things and like set tasks myself because i'm behind on so many things like um i haven't updated my like to know it page in ages which is the place where i link all of my outfits i'll link it below it's always linked below but i link all my outfits that I haven't updated that in ages um my highlights on my instagram are all so old i need to update those um what else do i need to do just like random things i've just been like not I've been so like putting things off because I can't be bothered and I actually just need to be like, no, do it. Um, so yeah, I'm kind of just trying to get myself back into that routine of actually being organized and actually sorting yourself out and not just doing things willy nilly. Do you know what I mean? Um, so yeah, but it's very, very close to the 12th of April and I bet you're all very excited for the 12th of April too. Um, I've booked to have my nails done on the 13th. Woo! Um, I'm sure I will share that with you when I get to it. And I've also booked to have my hair done. Um, my hair is like a tad dry. It's kind of like, um, the split ends are there. They're real. Do you know what I mean? Um, I haven't had my hair cut since November 2019. So this has all like been growing since then. Um, and it's in dire need of a haircut. And I don't, I'm not usually one to be like, I'll oh, cut my hair, like it'll be fine. Cause I quite like my hair. It's always like a comfort blanket thing. But 
this time I'm actually like, do you know what? Chop the ends, let it grow. I want it to be in good condition, you know? Um, I really wanted my hair to be super long for summer, but I've got to look after the state of my hair. So I'm excited to have it cut. I'm getting it dyed too, which again, very excited about because I haven't had my hair dyed in almost a year. Um, so I'm going to feel like a new woman and I'm very excited about it. But anyway, I'm going to stop talking to you because I've been chatting for five minutes. Oh, I hate myself. Every time I vlog, I just... I just film so much stuff. Oh, I'll tell you what I did last night. Sorry, I'm, I haven't updated you guys in ages. So I wanna show you. So this is my lovely wardrobe. As you know, I've done a video on it. Hang on, just closing my underwear drawer. Right, um, last night I put um, all of my stuff on new hangers and I am honestly obsessed. Let me show you. Look at this. All of my hangers match. They're all black. They're all nice. They're all pretty. Um, they do fill up my wardrobe a little bit more than the metal ones. I still have the metal ones, by the way. Um, but yeah, I'm liking it. Obviously, these ones are metal. But I'm thinking at a later date to get. You can get these little velvet clips to put on black hangers like this um, to hang trousers and stuff. So I might do that at a later date. Don't really need to do that now. Um, but yeah looking really pretty i'm very happy about it what i'm thinking what i'm thinking of doing is i bought these um vacuum pack bags and i'm gonna vacuum pack my coats and stuff the ones that i probably won't wear over the coming weeks and stuff and i'm going to move my jackets and blazers into the wardrobe out there which i've mentioned before and then i can hang more of my clothes in my actual wardrobe um it's not urgent i don't need to do it now but that's something i'm gonna do i'll probably film it at a later date anyway bloody hell i can't stop talking do you know what another reason why i can't stop talking is because um no one's at home and when no one's at home like sarah's out shooting grace is at work i have no one to talk to <laughs> so i'm just gonna have to talk to you guys and you're gonna have to deal with it but anyway, I am actually going to go and sit and do my YouTube video. Um, YouTube video? I'm going to do the description for my YouTube video and watch some YouTube. So you can watch me do that. <laughs> like an hour later um and i finally sorted my video out it's uploaded it's up done the thumbnail i've done the reel um to go with it which will be going on instagram this evening and now i'm gonna go eat some food because i'm starving i also just listened to the girls bathroom podcast i don't know if any of you guys watch watch it um oh we're going really dark um i don't know if any of you uh listen to it um it's really good podcast it's probably the only podcast that i really actually properly listen to so yeah anyway i'm really really hungry it may only be half 11 but your girls call it eat and i've got this like pasta thing in here ah, ah. it's okay it's safe. look at the state of our cupboard <laughs> um Got this pasta thing okay we're going over this side because it's way brighter over here let me find something to put you on um that's not tall enough what about the butter um yeah it's probably not the best thing for you but i don't care to be honest. um but i'm gonna cook it because i'm hungry and I need some food, so what oh, oh, this isn't the same one that I got. This is a different one. I'm sure it'll taste yummy though. Um so I'm feeling very good today. Like I've got a lot of work done. I say a lot of work done, I haven't but I 
done a mediocre amount of work, you know. But it's going to sure why I'm showing you this because it doesn't look like anything special Ex special special right now but here we are but do you know what I can do I can show you our new little drinks trolley that Grace's mum bought us but I feel like every time I vlog in this room I tell you something new like look at the state of our living room it's a state like not even because we intend on it being messy but where we haven't got everything for this room yet and where we're like kind of not focusing our energy on this room right now it's a mess um soon we will have new things for this room as soon as i can show you as soon as i can show you new things in this room i will why is it so loud but for now <laughs> um just have little updates every now and then but we've got a new drinks trolley which we've been on the hunt for a drinks trolley for ages um and we didn't want to spend loads of money on it anyway grace's mum bought us one from bnm so i thought i'd show you here she is in all her glory excuse the dust on the floor um i need to clean um but this is the drinks trolley it's very little it's not very big at all um but to be honest we don't really need a big drinks trolley because like we're not like major alcoholics or anything we don't have loads of alcohol we have more than that but um this is all we've put on there for now um and what we're thinking is getting maybe like a little side table next to it and then like a lamp that will kind of like fill the space a bit more um and maybe a bigger plant i'm not sure yet um but yeah i just want to make the room feel more like kind of homey because at the moment it's not very homey but like i said we've not tried <laughs> at all um so yeah it's just kind of is what it is um but yeah that is our little drinks trolley i'm just gonna check my press on, give it a mix i'm slightly concerned i'm not gonna like this because it's not what i thought it was gonna be but it's fine we move we move we move i was thinking about filming some videos today but i don't know if i can be bothered there's also road work going on across the road which i didn't realize um, I say road works, they're just digging up the path, but you know, still technically road works. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna cook my lunch and I'll show you when it's cooked. Okay, here is my end result pasta. It doesn't look particularly appealing, but hopefully it will taste nice. Got myself a little Pepsi Max with a little glass straw. These straws are from Amazon, by the way. Amazing, highly recommend. I'll link them below. They're fabulous. And then I'm also watching um, a bit of Josie. Um, whilst I eat. So I say Josie, her name's Fashion Mumbler, Josie on YouTube. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna watch that now. Well, it is without doubt. That Verdict on the pasta was okay, wasn't amazing. It'll do the job, you know? But I just found out my Zara parcel is almost here. So, woo! I have, I'm sorry if I'm not giving a lot of energy today. It's hard to talk what can't speak apparently um it's hard to know what to talk about sometimes because i'm like mm, are you just gonna be bored of me talking about all the same things i will be doing more vlogs sorry i just bad um with the girls soon but i'm just trying to get myself organized so that i can plan this kind of stuff because i don't just get my camera out any other day like i have to think about when i'm going to get it out and when i'm going to film so i need to think about that um because obviously not every day is interesting most days are not interesting like today is not that interesting but i decided to film anyway so here we are <laughs> um but yeah i'm gonna wait for my parcel to come and i'll give you a little sneak peek when
gosh, I'm so excited. I honestly bought such an array of things. You know when you purchase things and you just think, why did I buy that? That's how I feel about some of these items. But I'm now going to set myself up. I've just given this a little bit of a tidy. I need to move that. And I'm going to sit here. Sit here. I'm going to stand here and film my Zara haul. So, yeah. I will link it below if you want to go watch it because it will be live by the time this is live. Um, yeah, I'm gonna film now. Afternoon. Um, it's a bit backlit there, aren't I? What's the time? It's half past two, and I finished filming my Zara video reel. I'm very excited to edit that, um, and I was gonna edit it, and then I realised that tomorrow is Thursday. And I plan to go shoot with Jess, got an email, um, tomorrow. And I haven't planned any outfits, so that's what I'm going to do now. I'm going to plan some outfits. Luckily I have some new bits from my Zara haul, which I can style up, which is great. I also have some other things that I want to style up anyway, like um, these bad boys. Uh, did I show you these? Did I show you these? I showed these on Instagram, I don't know if I showed them on here. Um, I'm trying to catch up on the things I haven't shown you, including my little Dior shoes there. I'll show you those eventually. Um, but my mum and dad bought me these for my birthday. Um, I have wanted a pair of these Comme de Garçon Converse, but literally yonks. And, um, I never really was at a point where I was like, I want to spend the money on them. And then I asked for them for my birthday and my parents got them. I went for the black with the little red hearts on the side simple i love them i just think they're really nice um if you know me you'll know i wear these pretty much all the time so i was like i'm gonna get the black ones um add them to my little converse collection um but yeah i want to style those up and potentially my dior's little sneak peek i might do a full video on these um i've not really had a chance to wear them because they hurt so yeah um what else do i want to potentially shoot i don't know I'm not really sure. But I'm going to go through my wardrobe and pull out some bits. I did film a vlog um, before of me like planning outfits. So I will link that below. Um, I don't actually know how long it is. I haven't edited, <laughs> edited it together. So let's hope it actually did come about and I did use the video content. But anywho, I'm going to plan some outfits now. I'm actually going to wash my hair later as well because it's like a grease ball. I don't know why, but since moving to London, my hair is so much more greasy. It's just not nice. And I'm trying to leave it as long as possible before I wash it again. And I'm also trying not to style it as much. But it's hard, especially when you're like shooting content or you're out and about doing things. I just hate having greasy hair. Um, so I do try to leave it as long as possible, but I will wash it tonight. I would, if I wasn't going anywhere tomorrow, I wouldn't wash it. But because I'm shooting, I don't want my hair to look meh. I want it to look nice because I'm shooting pics. Do you know what I mean? Anyway, um, I'm going to go see what that email was. And then I'm going to get planning some outfits. And I'll show you if and when I have some outfits together. <laughs> I have officially planned all my outfits. I'm feeling very inspired today. You know, like when you just keep finding outfits and you're like, oh, this is a good one. Oh, this is a good one. That's how I'm feeling today. I've planned seven. I don't know if I'll shoot seven, but I've planned seven um, because one of them is kind of like a could shoot, could not shoot kind of one. Um, but I just want to show you my last outfit whilst I'm still in it before I take it off because I'm going to end up in my joggers that you've seen all day. So I might as well show you something. So I am wearing the white shirt that I got in my Zara haul. Again, I'll link my Zara haul below in case you want to go and watch it if you haven't already. Um, it's kind of like an oversized shirt, kind of a dress, but not really a dress. Like I wouldn't say I couldn't really get away with this as a dress. You might, but I wouldn't. Um, so I'm wearing cycling shorts underneath, which I probably would do anyway, even if it was a dress. Um, so yeah, but I kind of like that vibe. I think it gives a bit more of a kind of casual edgy vibe, which is like what I quite like to go for anyway. Um, and then I've layered over this sweater vest, which I got in winter from Zara. I'll link something similar below because I don't know if they still stock this, but if they do, I'll link it below. Um, it's just kind of like an oversized sweater vest. You could use any sweater vest. Um, but I like this one because it's not too long. I find sometimes sweater vests, 
why can't I say it? Sweater vests come like down to here and they just don't look right on me. I'm quite small and quite petite, so it doesn't really work. And then I've just whacked on my chunky docks because no shoot is complete without at least one outfit with my docks. Do you know what I mean? Um, but this is the pile of stuff that I'm going to take with me. I'm hoping I can pack it all a decent amount and it won't be too much. But we'll see. We'll see. I managed to style these up twice. I'm very happy about that. I'm here acting like, oh, so hard to style them. I wear Converse with everything. But you know when you're just like, the minute you really want to make them look good, it's like, how do I style them? Um, so yeah, but I've planned all my outfits. I've still got a few Zara pieces that I didn't style today, like this um and this scarf but i can shoot them another day it's not really an issue um i'm just trying to i'm gonna sneeze <coughs> i'm just trying to um style up items that i know that you guys will like and that is interesting and that's like kind of different to what i've already done i don't want to keep repeating myself but i also want to keep it as casual and my style as possible do you know what i mean so i think i've done it i'm actually really excited to shoot tomorrow um I think because like I've just got a few other pieces to just make my other items look good. I don't even know what I'm talking about at this point. Um, but what I'm going to do now, I'm just going to take my shoes off while I'm talking to you. Um, I'm going to vacuum pack some of my stuff down I think. Slash I really want, oh, I didn't realise how far away the wall was. <laughs> um, I really want McDonald's, I'm starving. It's, it's half four, the last time I ate was at half eleven. And I'm really, really considering getting McDonald's. Um, I don't know when the girls are going to be back. I don't think they'll be back early. Um, because Grace is meeting someone after work. And Sarah, I think she's going to the dentist, I believe. So I'm like, I could eat now and then maybe have dinner with them later. Do you know what I mean? Potentially kind of swaying towards that idea. I do love McDonald's, by the way. Like, I know I probably have mentioned this in a few vlogs. It's kind of like my weakness. Where I, I used to live at home, you had to drive to the McDonald's to get McDonald's. You couldn't just get it delivered. So I'm, like, really, like, making the most of the situation. And I have worked so hard today. Like, I've got so much done. Um, and I feel really good for it. Like, it's nice to actually get work done. Do you know what I mean? Like, I've been really struggling, and it's just nice that I've managed to do a lot. I'm really sorry if this vlog is long. I just talk a lot, and when I haven't vlogged in a while, I just feel the need to tell you everything. And I hope you don't mind. Um, <laughs> but, like, I edited a video, I edited a reel, I uploaded the video, scheduled it, ready for tonight. What else did I do? I filmed a video, my Zara haul. I'm filming this vlog. I filmed a reel for the Zara haul. I have answered emails, I've planned outfits. Do you know what I mean? Like I've done quite a lot and now I am ready to potentially have a McDonald's. I'm thinking McDonald's, shower, vacuum pack stuff. I might not do the vacuum pack stuff today. I might do that on Friday, maybe. I also need to put my new, my extra shelves in there um, because I've got quite a few like new shoes and I just want to kind of organise them a bit better. And I also want to put away my boots. So, like, I say put away my boots. I've got, like, mm, maybe four or five pairs that could go away that I just don't think I'm going to wear now. They're more wintry vibes. So, yeah. And if I pack down some of my coats, I might be able to put some of my shoes elsewhere. Do you know what I mean? Anyway, I'm going to get out of this outfit because I'm warm. I had to put my other radiator on to kind of warm up my room because there's nothing worse than trying on outfits when you're freezing. So I need to turn that off. Um, yeah. I'll let you know if I decide to get McDonald's. <laughs> Back in my comfies, and I realised I didn't actually show you what I was wearing today. Um, so I'm going to show you now. Um, I'm wearing this, excuse the mess by the way. We don't need to talk about it. Um, I'm wearing this jogger set, which is from Girl Knows All. I talk about Girl Knows All quite a lot. Um, a lot of my jogger sets are from there. And I love them. They're so comfy. They're, like, oversized vibes. I just love them. Like, I can't say anything bad about them. I just absolutely love them. I have so many. I rotate them. At the moment, this is my favourite one. You might have seen it before. I don't know if I've worn it before, but this is my favourite one. <laughs> um... I always get my sweatshirts in a medium. Granted, they're a little bit big when I wear them together, like this. I do look a little bit like a child's put on a too big tracksuit, but they're going to grow into it kind of thing. But 
Um, the reason why I always get my sweatshirts in a medium is because I like to wear the sweatshirts with other things. And in the summer, it's kind of nice to wear like an oversized sweatshirt with cycling shorts kind of look, which I quite enjoy in the summer. Um, or if you're going for like an oversized t-shirt look with cycling shorts, this is a good like piece to layer over the top kind of thing. This is why I always get them in a medium because then I can wear them multiple ways rather than it being a bit smaller and then not be able to get that look. Do you know what I mean? So yeah, they're in a medium and my joggers are in a small um, and they fit pretty decently. I do roll them over at the top sometimes just because sometimes they bag a little bit too much because um, I'm small. And then my slippers are from... Where are these bad boys? Bo Why can't I speak today? I've had too much. I've just... Ugh. I've done a lot today. I, I don't know. Um, these are from... Where are these from? The White Company. I'll link them below if they're in stock. If not, I'll link something similar. Um, yeah, look at this mess. Look at this mess. Uh, also, the verdict on the McDonald's. I've lost my phone. Where is my phone? I had it. <laughs> what? Anyone else do this? Like, they have something in their hand. They're using it. Oh, it's here and they can't find it. It's half past four. Um, I did I say that? I feel like I already said that. Um, and I messaged the girls, I was like, when are you coming home? Just like, let me know. And they were like, and I was like, I'm only asking, cause like, I want my donuts. And they both said that they're gonna be back late. So, I'm gonna get myself a McDonald's. Um, and I'm also gonna buy myself a McFlurry because pff, why not? <laughs> obviously <laughs> now nah, i don't need a mcflurry but i could do with a mcflurry and since it's half past four i will be hungry later i might as well make the most of it but before i order it i'm gonna tidy up because i think i'll regret it afterwards and i might want to chill later so i'm gonna tidy and then chill order my mcdonald's obviously <laughs> you're probably thinking charlotte is it the next day no same day different jogger set from Adenola um because I was about to put a light wash on and my jogger set needed a wash because I got curry on it yesterday um I wasn't wearing it all day yesterday I just wore it in the evening just in case I like to make the most out of my jogger sets anyway not the point so I'm gonna basically put them in the wash um but this is my pile of bits and bobs that I want to shoot tomorrow well that I am going to shoot tomorrow it looks like a lot because I've got four pairs of shoes. I've got like four bags. Usually I try to limit it down, but um, not tomorrow, apparently. Um, so yeah, basically that's that. I'm gonna pack it later. Can't be bothered to do it now. Um, I also have my Adenola bag, which I shrunk in the wash. Well, I didn't shrink it. I washed it normally, but it shrunk. So I don't think all of my stuff's gonna fit in this. So I might have to take a suitcase. Um, but I will link it below anyway. Just don't wash it and just wash the machine. Maybe put it on a hand wash. Um, but I ordered my McDonald's because it's later on in the day. Um, it's not going to arrive for like another 20, like another half an hour. So I'm going to go sit downstairs and chill on the sofa for a bit and put my washing in. I was going to say in the wash. Is that right? Put my washing in the wash. Put my washing in the washing machine. Um, but it's 5 pm now, so basically the end of the day but i'm gonna sit and like plan some ideas and stuff i think we'll see <laughs>